This week we are doing an experiment with a small number of students, different ages, um, but they all have one thing in common and that is that they cannot draw. They will profess to not being able to draw at all. Um, they're going to start by doing a series of tasks and exercises, activities that will basically confuse one side of the brain, that's the dominant side of the brain, um, into not being able to function. So the other side of the brain, the right side of the brain, takes over functioning and dealing with the task. Being confident using my um, imagination or just being quick. So never, never give up on what you're doing. If you're like, you can't do it, sort of get help and then like retry again and again. Like I said, I'm very creative and I like to do lots of creative outlet stuff so that will probably help like new ideas and not thinking of like just a really, like unoriginal thing to be able to think more of originality probably. Like I said they're kind of at the beginning of the week. With a learning attitude, but I, yeah, this isn't going to work out me. But they were nice enough to entertain me. Um, and they were open enough, they were open their minds enough to give new things a go, which was all I needed, because that allowed me to, to start giving them activities that they could break down and manage, and then it got harder and harder. Um, and it, it's shown then that They've, in their words, they've made the impossible possible. Mm. 